Video game art is a specialized form of computer art employing video games as the artistic medium. Video game art often involves the use of patched or modified video games or the repurposing of existing games or game structures, however it relies on a broader range of artistic techniques and outcomes than artistic modification and it may also include painting, sculpture, appropriation, in-game intervention and performance, sampling, etc. It may also include the creation of art games either from scratch or by modifying existing games. Notable examples of video game art include Cory Archangel's Super Mario Clouds and I Shot Andy Warhol. Joseph Delapie's projects including Dead in Iraq and the Salt Satyagraha Online, Gandhi's March to Dandy in Second Life. The 2004-2005 Rhizome Commission's Relating to the Theme of Games. Paolo Pedercini's Malindustria games such as Unmanned and Every Day the Same Dream, and Ian Bogost's Coklicker. Artistic modifications are frequently made possible through the use of level editors, though other techniques exist. Some artists make use of machinima applications to produce non interactive animated artworks, however, artistic modification is not synonymous with machinima as these form only a small proportion of artistic modifications. Machinima is distinct from art mods as it relies on different tools, though there are many similarities with some art mods, like video games. Artistic game modifications are often interactive and may allow for single player or multiplayer experience. Multiplayer works make use of networked environments to develop new kinds of interaction and collaborative art production. Techniques <laughs> 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 Machinima Machinima is the use of real-time three-dimensional graphics rendering engines to generate computer animation. The term also refers to works that incorporate this animation technique. In-game intervention and performance Artists may intervene in online games in a non-play manner, often disrupting games in progress in order to challenge or expose underlying conventions and functions of gameplay. Examples of this include Anne-Marie Schleiner's Velvet Strike a project designed to allow players of realistic first-person shooter games to use anti-war graffiti within the game to make an artistic statement and Dead in Iraq an art project created by Joseph de Lapp in which the player character purposely allows himself to be shot and then recites the names of U.S. soldiers who have died in the Iraq War. Site-specific installations and site-relative mods Site-specific installations and site-relative gaming modifications mods", replicate real-world places often the art gallery in which they are displayed to explore similarities and differences between real and virtual worlds. An example is what it is without the hand that wields it, where blood from kills in Counter-Strike manifests and spills into a real-life gallery. Real-time performance instruments Video games can be incorporated into live audio and visual performance using a variety of instruments and computers such as keyboards embedded with music chips. See also Chiptune and the Fiju project. <laughs> Generative art mods Generative art mods exploit the real-time capabilities of game technologies to produce ever-renewing autonomous artworks. Examples include Julian Oliver's IOQ3 A Paint, a generative painting system that uses the actions of software agents in combat to drive the painting process, Alison Mealy's Unreal Art which takes the movements of game entities and uses them to control a drawing process in an external program, Kent Sheely's Cities in Flux. A Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas mod that glitches and distorts the game's world in real time, and RetroUse R.C. Racer a modification of the graphic elements of a racing game which results in rich fields of color and shape. See also Art game 
Democene Digital Art Electronic Art Electronic Language International Festival Game Masters Game Studies Interactive Art Internet Art In-game Photography Mod Video Gaming Modding Software Art Video Games as an Art Form Virtual Art Topic Notes Topic Sources Game Scenes Art in the Age of Video Games Johan and Levi 2006 Edited by Matteo Bitanti and Domenico Quaranta Introduction to Artistic Computer Game Modification by Rebecca Cannon PDF file Backed up here 3 by Rebecca Cannon PDF file Backed up here 4 Video Games and Art by Andy Clark and Greth Mitchell EDS, Journal of Media Practice Vol. 7, No. 1 Special Edition on Video Games and Art by Andy Clark and Greth Mitchell EDS, Switch, Art and Games Issue, 1999, Online Magazine of the Cadre Laboratory for New Media, San Jose State University from First Person Shooter to Multi-User Knowledge Spaces Matthias Fuchs and Sylvia Eckerman Consum Art Server and Tracker Marguerite Jarman and Max Moswitzer Messages for a First Person Perspective Maya Engeli Smuts, Aaron 2005. Are video games art? <inaudible> <inaudible> external links Art Games Archive with examples of artistic modifications Art Games website with various examples of artistic modifications Art Games Archive with examples of artistic modifications <inaudible>